Hi, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to go to a library database and select a whole bunch of uh, articles that you might be interested in importing into your um, bibliographic management software and then download that one file as a package so that it has multiple citations of references you want to use uh, with one download and then import that into Zotero or Medley, Mendeley um, so that uh, it imports multiple bibliographic references all at once instead of you having to type them in uh, one at a time. So the first thing you're going to do is go to the Biola library, library.biola.edu, and then you go to research and uh, articles and databases, and then you'll pick a, uh, a research, uh, research database that closely fits your uh, academic discipline. So let's just try Academic Search Premier. And then uh, you might have to log in if you're off campus. Okay, once you get to Academic Search Premier, you're going to search uh, for a subject heading, and those come up with something like Google Suggest. Um, suppose that I wanted to do something on uh, medical missionaries. So, medical missionaries comes up as a search, and then it's going to turn up 187 options. Well, I'm not going to sit here and go through them, but I'm going to show you, um, let's pretend that I did spend enough time to decide which ones I want and which ones I don't. And if I want this one, I'm going to click the plus in the folder right there. And now it's added to my folder. I'm going to uh, drag that over here and show you uh, what that folder, you can see here, there's a, uh, the folder has an item. So I'm going to go down here, I want this one, and now my folder has two items here. Um, I want this one, I don't want that one, I'm going to leave it, don't want that one, don't want that one, and let's say I want this one. Now note that there's multiple pages here, I've got uh, 180 some, so there's going to be a bunch of pages. Um, so let's just say I wanted this one, and this one, now you're going to go through them and actually uh, decide which ones you really want. Alright, so now my folder has items. I'm going to go to my folder view, go to folder view, and then I'm going to click export and now it says direct export in RIS format and note that here it has um, Zotero specifically mentioned and EndNote specifically mentioned so RIS is what I want and then when you're on that screen you can uh, what I suggest you do is remove them after saving so that your folder can be used later and then click uh, save now that RIS is going to be up here I'm using Safari in my downloads folder. So wherever your downloads folder is, that's where it's going to be. And it's called delivery-3.ris. Uh, yours might be called delivery-1 or something. Anyway, that's your delivery, or that's your RIS file. So take that, however you get your downloads folder, and drag it to your desktop. Okay, so you can see um, that I dragged it to my desktop here. And then the next step is to open Zotero or Mendeley. And so I've opened up Zotero here. And you go to uh, uh, up to File, Import, and it's going to look, you can, you can tell it to specifically look for RIS files. So I've changed it to RIS files. Now these are going to be on my desktop, and so you can see delivery3.ris is right there, and now it's imported them, and here they are. And it has the bibliographic information already in there, title and author and everything. If I select one, you can see over here, it knows it's a journal article, who the author is, the publication, volume, issue, page number. It has all of it already in there uh, for each of these bibliographic uh, references. And so that saves you a lot of time. 